I have found Mount Beth Bethel to be a blessing to me because uh, it has strengthened my faith in God and because it has caused me to get involved in projects which benefit human beings in many different ways. My responsibilities are to try to create an endowment fund for Mount Bethel, which will ensure the success of the church, uh, not just now, but into the future, and to enable the church to do projects that uh, it might otherwise not be able to do. I referred Dick Stafford to the foundation because I believed that it would be good for the church, and that I believed it would be good for Dick Stafford. It provides them a chance to earn, earn a attractive rate of income. It gives them very significant tax benefits. And eventually, when he passes on to the father, he will uh, leave a substantial sum to the church. I knew it was a good cause. It was good for Mount Bethel. And it was good for Dick Stafford. My advantage is myself, I had a high interest rate. The first contract was something like 7.4%, pretty high. The second contract was 7.8%, and that was pretty good too. Mount Bethel could share in the funding at a later date. And then I, my, I benefited also, and this funding goes on until I die. Well, leaving a legacy is important to me because I believe in it. I believe in the church and I believe in the Methodist church and therefore it would be a good cause down the line. God comes first and I have tried to do that all my life. The emphasis of the Georgia United Methodist Foundation over the next couple of years will be to assist our churches and ministries in developing planned giving programs. These programs are essential to the success of our churches and ministries considering that between 40 and 130 trillion dollars will change hands in the baby boom generation. As president of the Georgia United Methodist Foundation, I look forward to working with you and I want to thank you for allowing us to be your partners in ministry.